Deluxe Lobo Assembly and Product Info. The first step is to check the box for damage. It should be free of any dents, tears, or holes. Next, you want to open the box, take out all the pieces, and check for damage before beginning assembly. Be sure that you allow yourself enough room to work and provide yourself with a clean and level workspace. As you lay your parts out, double check that everything is accounted for. If anything appears damaged or missing, please contact the retailer immediately and they will guide you through the steps needed for replacements. You will find your hardware properly labeled. Stand the easel upright and secure the side support in place with a screw and black plastic knob. You will then want to repeat this on the other side. Next, secure the upper H frame to the easel using a screw, slide guide, and black plastic knob. You will repeat this on both sides. Using a screw and black plastic knob, secure the back support to the H-frame on both ends of the support leg. Next, you will loosen the mast locking mechanism and slide the large canvas tray onto the frame. And next, you will slide the mast onto the frame. By tightening and loosening the black plastic knobs, you can secure the mast to your desired position. Loosening and tightening the black plastic knobs allows the Deluxe Lobo to tilt forward to reduce glare and prevent dusting and backward to form a table for gessoing, watercolors, and varnishing. A hinged oak veneer plywood shelf beneath the frame provides storage for books or supplies. The best deluxe logo is an easel to accommodate the watercolorist pastel artist and oil painter.